my name is Lindsay, and today I'm going to show you all 13 quests within the dormitory bathing quarters. And that will include the chest in the vents and out of the vents. In total, I have 13, and I'm pretty sure that might be all of them. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I'm going to show you how you can get to the maze because there still seems to be some confusion on how to get there. So once you enter the bathing quarters, you are going to take a left right here. And you will see this sign, locker, showers, vanities. You're going to go through this door. And then once you are here, you're going to look to your right and you'll see the laundry room. And once you come to this dryer right here, you open it and you can go into the vent. Okay, so these chests are pretty far apart and there will be a lot of long hallways. So for the first chest I'm going to show you, we are going to go straight and when you get up here, you will see two turns. I am going to go left and now I'm going to take a right and now I'm going to take another left and we are going to enter one of our first long hallways, but the one we are going to get is in a secret wall. You go through one of the walls, so to get to that wall, you're going to go past these two corners, and we're going to go past these two corners right here, and you will see one hallway right here. Right across from it is the first chest, and I did get this one already. It is the flashlight. And if you're wondering where your flashlight went, it went into your backpack if it's not currently out. It is in your backpack. It is a backpack item. Now that we've gotten the flashlight chest, we are going to leave. And when we leave, we are going to take a right, and now we're going to take another right, and we're going to come down here. And now you're going to take a left and you should see smoke coming out of a vent down here. If you do, you're in the right area. And now we are going to go through this wall right here. And there is another chest. I have not opened this one yet, so I'm super excited to see what it is. It is 1,500 diamonds. Okay, so now we are going to leave. And you're going to take a left right at this turn. And now we're going to go straight. The chest is straight. There will be another wall we can go through. So just go ahead and go through that wall. And you're going to continue going straight. And here is another chest. So let's go ahead and open it. Okay, so there's going to be a weird jump cut because I got kicked out of the server, but I came back to the chest we just got, which is the 1,250 diamond chest. And so now we are going to leave. We have to go back through this wall right here. And now we're going to go straight. You'll see this turn right here. We're going to go past that and we're going to go to this one. So we're going to take this left turn and then we are going to take a another left and once we get to this last hallway, we are going to go down that. So we're going to go right. And in case you're wondering where we are, we are right across from the flashlight chest. So if you're lost, that is where we're at. So we are going to go down this hallway and we will be able to go through this wall right here. And there is a chest. And in this chest, we have 1,337 diamonds. And now there is another wall we can go through, but there are three vents. So what you're going to want to do is make sure your run speed is on so you can run because you need to be fast. You don't want to fall down any of the vents. What I like to do is do a run and jump combo like this. And we made it to our next chest, which is 2,000 diamonds diamonds and now just so we don't have to go back over the vents i am just going to reset and go back to the beginning so now we're going to go get the rainy day classroom chest so we are going to go straight we are going to take a left now we're going to take a right and we're going to take another right and now all we have to do is go straight down this really long hallway and there is a chest we will be getting on our way to the rainy day classroom because that chest is right next to the rainy day classroom chest. So it is on the way. So we will be getting to chest. So just keep going down this hallway. It is really long. Oh my goodness. 
So you see this wall right here, we can go through that wall. So you're going to go through this wall right here and you will see a chest, which is 900 diamonds. So I want to give a warning about the rainy day classroom chest. If you are getting this chest in a round of musical chairs start, you will get pulled into the game. So it can be a little tricky getting this chest. So we are gonna go through this wall right here and we're gonna go down this vent. Okay, we made it to the rainy day classroom. So now you're going to go straight until you get to this vent right here and you're going to fall down it. Now we're outside the rainy day classroom so we can go over to the tower and get to the chest. Now we did open it last night and in this chest it is 300 XP. I love how this school has XP in the chest. So if you don't have all the chests yet from the vent, you're going to have to teleport there again. You'll have to go through the castle dormitories because as of the recording of this video, you can't teleport from this realm. Okay, we made it back inside the vent. So we're going to go straight, but this time we are going to take a right. So we are going to go this way. And then our first right we are going to take. So right here, we are going to go right. And now we're going to go down this hallway, which feels like we are going in circles and it is pretty long. So just follow this long hallway. And again, it will feel like you are going in circles, but you're not. You're going in a straight line, I promise. And once we reach the end of this hallway, there will be a vent that we'll need to jump over. So we are almost to the chest. I think that might have been our last turn. Let's see. No, it is still going. Oh my goodness, I forgot how long this hallway was. So just keep going. And right here is the vent we need to jump over to get to the chest. And in this chest is 250 XP. So once again, we need to go back over the vent and we need to go back down this really long hallway to get to the next one. So just keep leaving this hallway and then once we get to the main hallway, I will show you where we need to go. So just keep going. Maybe if I put my run speed up, it'll be easier. So let's get to the end of this hallway. Oh my goodness, it is so long. Most of the hallways these chests are in is really, really long. Okay, so once we get to this point, we are going to take a right and we're just going to go down this really long hallway we will need to drop down into a vent so after we get this chest we will be restarting again so right here is the vent go ahead drop down you may bounce a little bit but it's fine here is the chest 1000 diamonds if you want you can climb up the ladder but i just feel like it is easier to reset the character Okay, we are back at the beginning of the vent. So we are going to go straight once again. We're going to take a left. We're going to take a right. Now we're going to take a left and we're going to keep going down this hallway. You will see these two turns. We're going to go past them. We're going to pass these turns as well. And we're going to go down this turn right here. It is a right turn and we're going to go down. And now we're taking a left. And there will be an XP chest down this way. It is a green chest and it is 325 XP. Okay, so I'm back at the beginning. Um, I found another chest after I finished filming. So I'm back at the beginning and now we're going to go straight. And I'm pretty sure this is the last vent chest. So now we're going to go right. And you're going to go past these two corners right here. Just keep going down this hallway until we see this right passage right here. And then we're going to turn right. So now we are going to go down this hallway. And once we reach the end of this hallway, we're going to go right. Because if you look to your left, there is a hole. So we're going right and you'll see this passage. And then on the second passage, we're going to go down. There will be a wall, you can tell, because there's obviously a fan right here because you can see the smoke. So we're going in and there is a chest. So let's go ahead and open it. And in this chest, we get 1,000 diamonds. And now I'm going to show you the two chest locations that are just in the bathing quarters. So outside of the vet maze 
in the bathing quarters. Okay, so this next chest is in the laundry room. I just exited the maze, so... It is kind of a chest you have to be lucky to get because you have to go down this slide in the basket. There are two sections to the slide. The chest is on the second section. Now, I do have a clip of me getting this chest. So, what I recommend you do is once you get to the second section, you should jump out of the basket. Let's see if we can get lucky. So, I'm going to get on and I'm going to click take off and let's see what happens. So if we manage to get to the second section, you're going to want to jump out of the basket. I'm going to show me doing it. I have a clip of me doing it perfectly, so you will kind of know what I mean. chest you're going to want to come to this room right here it is the relaxation room you're going to enter and you're going to look up and you can see water so you're going to fly up here and on this ledge will be a chest it is a 850 diamond chest location and i'm pretty sure that is all 13 chests within the dormitory bathrooms as well as the vents the vents is part of the dormitory bathrooms so all the chests I showed you today is all 13 chests. I'm pretty sure if I find more, I will let you know. But please make sure you like, subscribe, and turn that bell notification so you never miss when I post. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!